Hey guys, Jordan Davis here with Coldlytics, and today I want to show you how to target the best construction companies using Coldlytics. So let's get into it. So step one, we're going to start with our targeting, and we're going to go with small businesses. And today we're going to Springfield, Misery. Uh, so select that. Um, 20 miles is, is a good enough range for this, so I'm going to add it. Um, and with that, I'm going to hit next to lock it in. Today we are looking for construction companies. Construction. We got a sanity check here. So this will basically show us companies that will appear in your lead sheet. So you can just select, or you can just click on these to see if these are, you know, companies that you want in your lead sheet. And if not, you can just adjust this search term to get, you know, a better idea of what you're looking for. So I'm going to add that. I'm going to hit next to lock it in. And we're going to go owners and founders and directors and executives. And I do these, uh, I select both of these metrics just in case the owner has a C-suite title, it'll cover for that case as well. So I'm gonna hit next. We have two filters a day for construction uh, or construction companies. The first one is a classic one. I always love this one, It's but it's Google reviews. I'm gonna leave the count alone and I'm going to set the score between three and five. Um, and that just means that the companies that you're looking for uh, have to have a positive reception, which is, you know, the benefit for you is that, you know, you want to work with a company that's well received by its clients and customers. So yeah, you know, it's uh, filtering by this is definitely a good indicator that you're working with a great company. So next to lock that in, um, I'm going to add another filter and for a construction company, I feel like headcount is really important. Like, you know, construction companies have like a lot of bodies on board. Um, and you want to work with a reputable construction company. So at least 50 employees. So I'm going to hit next for that and lock that in. And finally, we're going to go on to the deliver step. I'm going to just reset all these metrics. Honestly, all of them are really useful as you know, construction. There's so many cases, like you could be a digital marketing agency trying to sell your services to construction companies. You could be a concrete manufacturing company trying to get, you know, this construction company to use your concrete products. Um, you know, there's so many different industries that can sell to construction companies that I'm just going to keep this open ended and select all of the um, metrics here. Um, there is a lot of marketing ones and there's a lot of like sales related ones too. the marketing ones are kind of all the Google and social media related ones. And I find the sales ones are more like revenue, hate, hit count, data established. So just make sure to look for those metrics when your lead sheets come back in. I'm going to hit next to lock this in. We don't need any more additional notes, so I'm going to finish and make sure to give your uh, task a title as I have constructions in, construction in Springfield. Make sure to set your contacts required. And before you launch, just make sure to save it as a draft just in case you have to go back in and edit it if anything were to happen or if you wanted to change something you're not starting from zero. So with that being said, I'm going to launch this task. Once you get back out to your task overview, uh, you should see that your construction in Springfield tasks will be allocating. And once it's allocating, it just means that you can expect your lead sheet back in 24 hours. And with that being said, that's how you target the best construction companies using Coldlytics. So I hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you in the next video.